yeah hi we are from SVS embedded the project title name is called IoT based accident detection and tracking system on Google map web page so here I am using an uh, 889 S52 uh, 8051 GPRS modem GPS PHP MySQL and web page so this is uh, www.rpihealth.com slash accident underscore VT I created okay so 889 S52 N1 Max 232 IC level converter voltage level stabilization IC N1 GPRS modem I am using and here I am using one GPS VK16E 65 channel GPS module I am using and here I am using one 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on that should be displayed on the LCD and one driver IC and one buzzer and one driver IC and one engine and here I am using one MCP32088 ADC successive approximation 12 bit ADC and one uh, ADXL335 MEMS accelerometer sensor I am using let us coming into the hardware part so and first of all uh, I am going to show you the page so here I am using an uh, so IOT based vehicle accident detection and latitude value longitude value and date and time okay so here this is 541 okay this is GMT time and here this is my page IOT based accident detection and tracking system so where the accident is occurred latitude value longitude value with the google map page and this is my C panel details so here this is my entire code PHP code and this is my uh, ID MySQL database and here this is the light value lang value created date and time so I am pushing the data okay and uh, here this is my uh, code kill software code so where IOT based vehicle accident detection and entire code here the individual value I am passing okay so here first of all uh, 230 input a step down transformer 9 volts output AC center tap out transformer uh, 0 to 12 volts 0 to 12 volts is given to the uh, GPS model and another 0 to 12 volts it is given to the microcontroller board bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and one LED so here 889 S52 microcontroller 40 pin IC 4 ports each port consists of 88 pin total 32 input output bidirectional port 0 it is connected to the 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on that should be displayed on the LCD and this is the reset button and port 1 cap 3 and 1 cap 4 it is connected to the buzzer and DC motor if any accident is occurred alarm should be on engine should be off if nothing should be happen engine should on buzzer should off so like uh, this is the uh, left accident right accident back accident front accident so four accidents four individual values uh, we are passing to the one SMS alert and as well as one uh, we are sending the data to the web page so here uh, we are sending the data to the uh, web page and as well as one SMS alert back accident vehicle number 123 latitude value longitude value I am give I am passing the uh, URL link to the SMS where the accident is occurred and we can track onto the web page and we can see the data where accident is occurred so here I am using one GPS modem so bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and one LED and this is max 232 IC and this is G GPS 16 channel GPS module I am using and this is GSM modem sim 800L always face should be here only so here uh, we can open this okay so here one sim card is there uh, you can use any sim card but the internet sim card needed 2G sim card or 3G sim card okay press it and here 5 pins and 6 pins and 5 pins so this is sim 800L I am using and same power adapter I am using uh, bridge rectifier filter capacitor LM317 adjustable voltage regulator 4.2 volts LED and network LED and this is the max 232 IC level converter voltage level stabilization IC and first of all so first of all in our project so first we need to remove this power and give the power supply first and we need to check the status signal here or green color LED should be on 
when the green color LED should be on, we can track the latitude longitude from the uh, GPS satellite. Okay, so here uh, the second one is going going for the GSM model. So here one uh, LED is there. This is called the uh, signal LED, cell phone tower signal. We can track this uh, tower tower signal first. Means you require the network. Once the network will reach, then you have to go for the microcontroller board. GPS is coming perfectly, and uh, it is stopped. Okay. Okay. IoT based accident detection and tracking system. Then it is sending the AT commands to the GSM module. Once the AC AT commands are completed, then it is go going for the GPRS commands. GPRS start. So this LED means this LED means continuous blinking. So when the GSM is okay, now I am sending one SMS is called GSM test to okay. Okay. Once the GPRS settings are enabled to the this SIM card, that LED should be on. Once the GPRS came, then we will go for the accidents, individual accidents. here x coordinate value and y coordinate value both should be in a normal it is saying as a normal engine is on budget is off engine is on budget is off now we can go for the uh, accident left accident right accident front accident and back accident okay so here that led continuously led blinking starts okay you can observe now i am going for the okay left accident okay left accident latitude value longitude value sms sent first it will send the sms then it will send the gprs sent http starts okay HTTP latitude value longitude value and it will send to the server server sent okay okay so here so here 541 okay now the time is 634 yeah we got the SMS alert left accident when we open this rpihealth.com so where the exact of latitude longitude occurred now I am going for the right accident so it is giving the right accident right accident latitude value longitude value and it is updated onto the server also ok so here the page will continue every 30 seconds the page is refreshed and we are tracking the details of uh, latitude value longitude value 8642 ok 642 so we are getting the data next value okay no front accident front accident front accident latitude value longitude value left left accident right accident front accident back accident okay now you will get the sms alert like front uh, left accident right accident one front accident so if you open this if you open this that rpihealth.com slash accident identification okay light value lang value where exact the latitude value and longitude value should be shown okay so thanking you so we are also here also 842 843 okay last value it was uh, not updated why because it was uh, disconnected by the modem 
okay signals are not came so every every second x coordinate value y coordinate value we are continuously monitoring okay and i am going for the back accident back accident left right front back must and should you have to check the gprs connection the gprs connection should be perfect then you will get the exact output of latitude longitude from the uh, google map okay back accident front accident right accident left accident left right front to back okay so so we are going to uh, show you on the web page okay 844 okay so this is the status I'm thanking you if there is any doubt let me know to SVS embedded